Check it out. Could this be the future of art? A giant Bay Area mural painted by a robot. The technology is designed to cost half the price of a human artist. And as KPI X5's Kid Doe shows us, it gets the work done in a fraction of the time. Diego Rivera, eat your heart out. When they came to you and said, hey, I want a robot to paint this mural, you said what? I said, let's do it. This is time-lapse video of a robot. Yes, a robot painting a two-story tall mural on the side of a building in downtown San Jose. It's not so much painting as it is printing. Shooting paint from a computer-controlled rig, kind of like a giant inkjet printer. A mural this big can be printed in about two and a half days instead of the weeks it would take to do by hand and at half the cost of what a human artist would charge. They say they are not stealing artists' jobs. We're certainly not trying to take small platforms away from muralists. That's for them to do. Uh, we take a much larger uh, project and much uh, more complex pictures that need to be done cost effectively and in a much shorter period of time. Young Se Kim is the CFO of VBOT, a startup based in North San Jose. And when they say much larger projects, they're not kidding. VBOT's work can be seen on the sides of skyscrapers all over Korea. This is the first time their technology is getting rolled out to the U.S. VBOT says they're opening up murals to other artists like painters, photographers, and graphic designers. They don't have the ability to paint on these large walls, so they don't get the exposure that a muralist might be able to get. So we're trying to open up this platform to a much wider uh, array of artists uh, and a much wider community of uh, you know, contributors to the local art community. Maybe I'm crazy. <laughs> Jim Alves owns Hardcastle Auto Body, a family-run business for the past 92 years. Jim approved the design featuring the past, present, and future of automobiles with a nod to the valley's history of agriculture, even including the Lick Observatory. Jim sees the irony of an old-school operation using cutting-edge technology. This kind of is the new technology of using our, you know, our brain, our creativity to come up with the designs and then the machine coming back and making it happen for us. In San Jose, Kitto, KPIX5.